Hey guys, what's up? This is Katie Ersta and I am One Fit Fighter. So if you come across this page, thank you so much for being here. And so I have had this in my heart to talk about for a little over a month. It's just been something that's been on my mind. It's been something that I've been thinking about. So every month I run various challenge groups to help people achieve their health and fitness goals. And this month, um, it has been on my mind to create a type of group that is somewhat different than anything I've been a part of before and anything I've created before. So let me backtrack for a second and tell you a little bit about me and where I sort of come from. So I um, grew up uh, being slightly overweight, not morbidly obese, not crazy overweight, just a little bit overweight enough that I was extremely uncomfortable in my skin from about fourth grade on. Um, I just knew I was a little bit bigger than other girls in my class. And so this lifelong struggle of weight has had sort of started around the time I was about 10 years old. And so with that struggle, I really started to discover food and how I would feel when I would eat certain foods and the emotions that I attached when I would eat food. So I started to eat out of stress and I started to eat out of boredom and I started to eat a lot out of sadness. And with that came this this idea of weight going up and down and up and down. So for a long time, um, when I discovered Beachbody and being a part of Beachbody, I was really able to manage that. I was working out, I was eating really well, and I felt amazing. But sometimes um, in life, when I deal with stress, I still go back to some of those old habits because old habits can be really hard to break. And so in the past six weeks, I have undergone a lot of stress. And two of those stress factors are, are things that are kind of out of my control, but they I hate that because I love control and I wanna feel like I can control things. One of those stress factors is my health. Um, I underwent chemotherapy uh, for stage four Hodgkin's lymphoma last year. And I have been in remission for over a year. And at my last scan, the doctor decided that instead of waiting six months for the next scan, we're gonna wait three. He saw some things that kind of just, he wants to keep an eye on and, and be safe about and just be cautious about. So we decided to move that. Obviously, it's a, it's a source of stress. The other source of stress was a business goal that I had set for myself. And although I achieved the goal, I noticed that throughout the six-week process and working towards that goal, I was really not focused on my own health and fitness. I was putting myself last, and I was finding ways to deal with that stress and that anxiety through eating again. So it sort of came about. I know that I personally am a person who deals well with stress when I feel like I am giving to others and um, I am grateful for the things that I have in my life and I start my day with a grateful heart. So this new group is really for people who have those same type of issues, who have those same types of um, struggles. You know, you struggle with emotional eating. You struggle with your diet. You struggle with, you know, dealing with the emotions and the stresses and the sadness and the anxiety that you deal with, and you find a way to manifest it through food. And instead, I want to work with about 10 women who are committed to a challenge group online in a small, very closed setting where we will support one another. And I will be giving tips and motivation and recipes and ways that I've been able to really deal with my stress, but I am part of this journey with you. It is really important to me that I focus first on my health and my wellness because I know it has a ripple effect in the rest of my life. When I take care of myself, when I feel good, and when I know that I am blessed, I am a better, better mom, I am a better coach, I'm a better wife, and so I am looking for women who want that same thing. As the holidays approach and as stress comes into our life, as it always does, let's do this together. Let's focus on our goals together. Let's take this 30-day journey, possibly more, um, in the future, but let's take this next 30 days, starting on October 19th, to really refocus on us, take away the stress of our life and manifesting it through food, and really focus that energy on something more positive. I can't wait to work with you. Please make sure you comment interested in the comments below so that I can get more information out to you. I can't wait to work with you. Have a great day.